morning loves so it is the second day of school but the first day of classes for me um the class that we had scheduled for yesterday got cancelled and i am running late so sorry if i sound winded but i am all packed and ready to go with my umbrella lunch bag see y'all after class Classes are done. Hey, Drea. <laughs> Classes are done for the day. Drea and I just got some coffee from Rituals. That's like their version of Starbucks over here. And we are headed to the library to get some studying in. It was long, y'all. It was a long first day. I had lecture from 8 to 12, but I was clocked out from like 11. <laughs> then we had lunch and then lab was, well, I had lab from 2 to 3 and I was halfway clocked out, well, halfway sleeping there. Is extremely tiring but we are making it day one hitting the ground running and you know we hope to have good results at the end of the semester right yes we need incentive though other than A's and I need another incentive like I need a gift or something to look <laughs> <laughs> but yeah also keep our country in your prayers um, the Palms is currently suffering from a devastating hurricane Abaco and Grand Bahama so that has been on our hearts recently um, on our minds like all day every day we are praying for our friends and family back home and just ask that you keep us in prayer too bye bye been here about three hours now about to head home so i'm leaving the library sorry if it's so dark it's actually a library back there um and it's a little chart from where i live but i'm trying to power walk because it is dark and i'm not sure anyone can see me or hear me if i scream they really need to put lights in the back section but anyway I should be okay. Oh, this grass is high. Uh. Anyway, making walking back to my room so that I can get dinner and then probably study for the rest of the night. Bye, y'all. So this is SRC, if you've ever heard me talking about it in my stories. I don't know why it's not open 24 hours, considering it's a student rec center. But anyway, we usually get to study up there. And then there are some private study rooms up there at whiteboards. During final season, they keep it open 24 hours, which is very convenient, considering I live literally right down there. So especially at night, how I just had that far walk from the library in the dark. I think it would have been safer to be here versus the library. Considering everyone on my hall are medical science students. So vet, dent, med, pharmacy, etc. But yeah, oh, we also have a gym in there too, but that closes at 6.30. But yeah, I just wanted to give you all an idea of where that is in relation to where I stay. Bye. 
But anyway, I'm almost home now. Thankfully, I made it safe. No one tried to jump out and attack me. Praise God. I'm going to get something to eat. Relax for maybe 30 minutes, an hour, and get back to studying. Hey guys, so it's currently 1.12. I'm calling it a night. I'm in our study room that's upstairs in at the hall where I stay. Um, because I can't study in my room. I need to switch it up um, if I am <laughs> if I plan to be successful. But um yeah, it was a good day. I Classes was long, y'all. I don't know how this um, 8 to 12, from 8 a.m. straight to 12, straight lecture, like straight lecture. Had lunch from 12 to 1 and then went in the library to do some printing and then had lab from 2 to 3. Went in the library after lab to start studying and I was there until about 7, 7.30. Came home, took a break until, well, showered and then ate. And that took me until about 9.00. Um, just was talking to some friends back home and my family to see how they were doing. A lot of people lost everything, y'all. Like, it's, it's so sad and so heartbreaking. And it's really been taking a toll on me in terms of trying to focus on school while, you know, my heart, my mind is at home with my fellow Bahamians. So, yeah. I have no words. I'm just literally just heartbroken and sad. But I also have to remember why I'm here. And, you know, with me doing this and studying, hopefully one day I can be in the position to, or I will be in the position to offer my assistance or medical help when needed again. Or I preferably not for a disaster like this, but you know something else was to happen seriously and they need extra hands or extra assistance but hi i'm calling it a night that was my first day back um yeah so i studied in the library after i talked to my friends and my family came in here about 10 ish 10 30 and it's now one um just about done with the lecture that i wanted to complete probably get up early and try to finish that if i can definitely finish it tomorrow though at least my first pass and then review it again on the weekend but yeah maybe I'll show you how I study or the different things that I'm doing the things that work for me the things that don't work and just you know my overall plans for the semester but thank you all so much for your love and support and don't forget to like comment and subscribe and give it a thumbs up and I'll see y'all in the next video Bye.